If nothing else, history was on Queensland's side, the Reds winning their only previous Super 12 game at Athletic Park. The Hurricanes whipping up the crowd, dominating a frantic first 15 minutes. But gutsy defence and a southerly gave the visitors hope of a repeat performance. Beautiful kick from John Eels. Their two penalties were quickly made up by the Hurricanes, Wellington finding an answer to the strong breeze, the pack keeping the ball in hand, Jason O'Halloran capitalising. John Preston kicking the home side in front, then right on half time, George Laupevi put the locals nine clear, albeit a little fortunate. Yes, doubtful, wasn't it? Trailing 15-6, heading into the breeze, the scenario worsened for the Reds. Christian Cullen sending opposite Chris Latham to the stands. Didn't take his eye off the ball and took a courageous mark and he stayed down, not surprisingly. His replacement though, sparking the Reds, Shane Drum stepping his way to the line, this week making his mark from fullback. Cullen trying to repair the damage, putting the Hurricanes clear 22-13 with a smart kick and a bit of speed. And when Tana Umanga found himself on the end of brilliant support play, Wellington looked to have blown the Reds' chances just 10 minutes into the second half. Preston again. Queensland coach John Connolly looking for something to spark a Reds revival, replacing Elton Flatley with Jason Little, but it was another big name who began the Queensland surge. Tim Horan, and Horan scores it easily. 27-20, Daniel Herbert once again finding space in the Wellington defence, leading the visitors within range of the Hurricanes line. One phase later, this time Jason Little was happy with Herbert's brilliant form. Tries to flick it, Kefu. Jason Little will score an outstanding try and it'll be a seven-pointer. The score's level at 27. Two Preston penalties restoring Wellington's lead, but with Drum enjoying an overlap, the Reds were soon back within one. Drum on the blind side and he goes straight through. Wallaby skipper John Eels attempting to maintain his perfect conversion rate with the strong breeze and an impossible angle. It should have been worth more than two as the Reds went in front. Magnificent! 34-33. Tote Kefu wrapped up an amazing fight back just two minutes from full time. The crowd's early charge not preventing the loss of their side's bonus point. This time Mills enjoying a kinder position as the Reds reminded all they are once again serious title contenders. 41 points to 13.